exceed english grade 4 block number 7 writing a story lesson plan 2 drafting a story students will be able to plan a realistic fiction story using a story map let's read the story of ira and mani ira and mani are best friends mani invites ira for a sleepover in her house Ira is excited. Ira wants to take her teddy bear with her, but she feels that Mani might laugh at her. So she hides her teddy bear in her bag and takes it to Mani's house. At night, while Ira was brushing her teeth, Mani opens her bag to take out a book from it. When she sees the teddy bear, she takes it out and keep it on Ira's side of the bed. Then she runs and get her teddy bear too. When Ira comes out of the bathroom, she is happy to see Mani asleep with her teddy bear. But she is happier to see her teddy bear next to her pillow. So now students, can you tell me what was Ira's problem? What was the solution? How did the problem and solution make her feel? Is Ira's problem realistic? Let me conclude. The problem is that Ira feels Mani will laugh at her if she knows that she sleeps with a teddy bear. The problem is solved when Mani understands Ira's feelings and get her own teddy to show her friend that there is no reason to be embarrassed. Ira's problem, her feelings and the solutions are all realistic. Students, write the word embarrassed, afraid and guilty in your notebooks. Think of a problem that can make you feel like in any of these ways. Then think of a solution for it. After that, choose the character that could face the problem and bring about the solution. Characters, their problems, feelings and solution should be realistic. Let me help you with it. The problem and its solution and the feeling it brought about can be that you felt embarrassed when the teacher read aloud your low test marks. The problem can be solved by working hard for the next test and getting better marks. A good realistic fiction story has characters that feel and react like real people in real situations. It should have a problem that can happen in the real world and an interesting solution that changes the feelings of the character. What are some different ways we can begin our story? Some ways in which we can begin a story are by introducing the setting and the characters, having a dialogue exchange between the characters or by giving the solution in the beginning and the problem shown as flashback. Tick out your volume 1, S2, Drafting a Story, page number 42. First question. Fill in the story map with details for your own realistic fiction story. Settings In a classroom Characters Sasha, teacher, doctor Sasha, student Sasha studied in grade 4 in Goodwill High School. One day Sasha went to her classroom and saw that somebody had thrown her book on top of the teacher's cupboard. She took a chair and climbed up to get it. When she stood on it, the chair broke. Sasha fell down and hurt her leg. In the middle of the story, Sasha started crying loudly. The teacher with a worried face came running to help her get up. She took her to the school doctor. They then took her to global hospital. After doing an x-ray, the, doc the doctor said that she has fractured her leg. At the end of the story, the doctor and nurse put a cast on her leg. Sasha was happy that her leg was not pain. 
She was a little worried thinking about how she was going to walk but her teacher was feeling much better now that Sasha was okay. Give your story a title Sasha in trouble.